there's no second chances in game launches. One full step and you lost your momentum. For Apex Legends, none of us anticipated we'd be making a free-to-play Battle Royale game. Anybody can pick it up and play. And so there's no way to truly know how many players you're going to wind up getting on your launch day or even in your first week. The biggest problem you're trying to solve is scale and unpredictability. If there's a queue, if the servers are down, people go and play something else, and that's it. They're not coming back. We've launched a lot of multiplayer games, and we don't want to be in the business of figuring out how to most effectively host servers for players all around the world. We don't want to build tech. Tech is something we have to do to make great games, but you have to find great partners that you can work with that can help deliver the tech for you. Multiplayer was one of those great partners. Multiplayer game server hosting specialists, we're a division of Unity. When it came to launching Apex Legends, Google Cloud was the natural choice. Google Cloud has been a really good partner for us. Their tech is really, really cool. Google Cloud manages massive player volumes by providing a global presence in regions all over the world, where game servers can quickly be brought up with moments of notice in order to respond to a quickly changing player base. The preparation for launch of Apex was key. Multiplayer reached out to us and said, we want 120,000 cores to test it on. And that's an eyebrow raising number. We actually ramped up to a simulated 14 million concurrent players on Google Cloud. And to be able to do a test that big gave us great confidence going into launch day. The end result of the launch of Apex Legends was First and foremost, an incredibly successful game. We scaled up past even our highest expectations, and we wound up supporting over 2 million concurrent players across 175,000 virtual CPUs, uh, which is almost 90,000 Apex game servers. Through Multiplay and Google Cloud, we were able to serve a gaming experience to 50 million people in just over three weeks, and that astounds me. You don't get a different experience in one part of the world than you do in the other because the performance of the hardware, the performance of the network is consistent across the board. And that really helps uh, with pack loss and latency and some other really big advantages for players. It's a nice win for Apex Legends that we get to build on top of Google's private network and get all the benefits from it just naturally by running our servers on Google Cloud. The most important thing with a cloud provider is that you have trust in the people and that they are fully engaged and they fully understand um, the challenge that is ahead of all of us. And that's the primary goal of all of this, is to ensure that the people that have spent years of their life building the game that they love, that people get to play it and enjoy it immediately. That's what's really exciting about this launch.